Oh yeah, uh, back out again uh, after the Cape Raff, uh, just testing the leg out. I'm in Formby, which is in the northwest. I'm just walking around before I go to the beach, um, the Red Squirrel Sanctuary. Tons of signs of the uh, squirrels, of all the, you know, the cones on the ground. I think I've seen one, but he darted off. So I'm just going to wander around here, slowly heading towards the sea, and then we'll pitch well out the way of everyone. All right. Uses me in the woods. Looks like a little confidence course. Little stepping stones. Those you know form me, it's a super popular area. So I've done about seven miles. Um, I've camped in this area before, but I just had to mozzy rep up and cover myself up because this is the best place I can find uh, out the way of people. Um, it's more busy up towards Formby Point itself. I'm now I'm more towards Ainsdale Dunes here. Uh, but it's Tick City. Just hoping they die off later. Full of mozzies as well. So I've just I'm glad I brought me, uh, what was it, my jungle spray that I, I used in Scotland. I brought that out with me. Um, so I'm going to have a beer. Happy Father's Day, Dad. You're up there with Mum. Love you, mate. Miss you. Uh, we'll keep going. And then uh, I'm thinking about an hour set up and then we'll cook some dinner. But for now, it's going to reflect thinking of Dad. That's why not much talking on this one. Just me having a little wander around places I used to come to as a kid with my family, uh, getting eaten by mosquitoes and ticks at the moment. But we'll enjoy a beer. All right then. The moment you realise that you forgot your on your onions and peppers that you prepared last night. <coughs> I've got chicken and I've got noodles. Uh, just missing the onions and peppers. I'm devastated. I was really looking forward to cooking them tonight <laughs> and I prepared them last night. Oh, my head's everywhere. Anyway, just going to chill, give it another 45, set the tent up, then just cut the chicken and noodles. I'm just going to pitch just down there um, and then literally through the trees is the ocean. Range is quite rightly a super hot round here. 
um, no fires, no barbecues, even though I'm going to be cooking tonight. Um, but I do believe, uh, I do leave no trace. Um, so I've took myself well out the way of the beaten path. Even though, in, <laughs> in form, in Ainsdale Dunes, there's literally, the area is crisscrossed with paths. Um, but, I mean, there's a path literally 20 metres from where I am. But this is right up the eastern end. And even walking on the beach today, I could see Blackpool Tower where I live in Blackpool um, so I'm going to get a tent set up in that spot there the ticks seem to have disappeared now I've put this on maybe because they can't get the sweat or because the jungle mosquito stuff is taking effect I was made sure that I'm not in any ants nest or anything um, the place seems to be live with uh, critters uh, let's get a tent up then we'll get some dinner on Minus the peppers and onions, which I'm devastated about. But we are where we are. Look. You know, it's been absolutely beautiful weather for the last two weeks. It hasn't been roasting today. It's still absolutely lovely. Um, I'm just going to take it quiet, though, because I can still hear people walking around. But to, you've got to come through loads of undergrowth to get to where I am. So let's get a tent up quietly. So tonight back out with an old friend, the Nature Help Cloud Peak. Um, I've fast since before last winter I've been in one man tents and everything I've done. So it's nice to be back in a two man tent. And this is an old friend, an old faithful. So I'm going to enjoy being here tonight. Sun's come out, which is stunning. So about half an hour's time we'll whack some dinner on. But we're all set up. And an old friend, happy days. I don't know if you can make it out. The sun there and it's shining down here. I keep the faith all the time. And I really do believe that's my mum and dad and my sister up there. Shining light down on me. It's what keeps me going. Um, really is a difficult time. Oh, and it's difficult... Uh, when it's remembering times, you know, you just got to get on with life, haven't you? Everyone's going through hard times, but fills my soul full of joy. Very mosquito y about the moment, super mosquito y. Oh my god! Uh, but a jungle repellent thing seems to be working out. That has been that's been on my cap, my head, everywhere. Uh, it's been fine. A tick seems to have bailed since I put this on. I think you like the orange t shirt. Um, there's not much on the tent going for that. So, uh, one or two, there they are. Little bad boys. Little bad boys. Right, I'm going to get dinner on very shortly. And then I'm going to get tucked in. Last time I was here, I had a signal. So I thought I wouldn't download much onto my phone. I'd say I just watch Virgin on my phone. Uh, I always keep some stuff downloaded in case I'm in a traffic jam or something. Got no signal. I uh, can't believe it. Uh, middle of form, but you've got no signal. But it is what it is. I've got something to watch. I'm going to get some dinner on. I'm not get upset about not having the peppers and onions. I'll enjoy them tomorrow night. But what a spot. Literally past them trees is the ocean. Uh, in fact, let's show you. There you go. Tides begin to come in now. I didn't go down to the sea before because the tide was out. Absolutely stunning. On that side, you got the sun glistening on it. But I'm going back to where I'm camping. It's just tucked away down here. Right, dinner on. Um, then after dinner, I think you've had enough of me by then. Plus, I want a bit of quiet time as well. That's why I'm out. So, uh, continue getting bitten by the mosquitoes, which is fine. Makes you feel good to be alive. 
in the sand dunes of Formby stroke Ainsdale, just tucked away there. Tonight's dinner with noodles minus onions and peppers. First Rangier meal. I'm quite happy with that. They're uh, minus the peps and onions, of course. Happy days. I'm going to tuck into this now. You can't come and do a coastal camp without seeing the sea for the final time this evening. You can see where it's dark. That's where high tide is. So we're nearly there. Um, make it out. But Blackpool's literally over there. But now, time to get to the tent and chill out, but oh, amazing, I, I love the sea, I don't know, I love being up mountains, but something about the sea and the waves, anyway, I'm in the wood just there, stunning, night night. <laughs> Now a calm morning, absolutely battered down last night, uh, we had uh, proper thunderstorms, I was going to get up and see if I can get a sunrise, but at 3 o'clock the lightning kicked in, uh, the tent did brilliant, the old nature hike, so that was cool, uh, I'm going to get a brew on now, pack up and get off, or get off. what time are we on? Yeah, it's just half five now, so let's get a brew on, then we can uh, get packed up and mooch out of here. I've been going about a mile now, just pushing through the woods again. Um, and start about three miles back to the car. Just going to love and leave you now. Um, quick camp, I enjoyed it. Um, good weather, except for the thunderstorm last night, but it was nice actually being in the tent listening to that. Um, so, to all the fathers out there, have a good day, the best you can. And everyone stay safe, and I'll see you soon. Take care.